What's up guys and welcome to Flipping the Script Fishing. I've been using a method to measure my bass and find out their weight for years. Now, it has proven to be very accurate within a couple ounces, one way or the other, of an actual weight. And I have been able to test that not only in tournaments, but on my own scales. And the problem is those scales will wear out and they're not always really accurate. Math is always the same. As long as I'm getting an accurate measurement, I can find out a very accurate weight for my fish. I will show you that equation and all you need to take with you out on the water is a tape measure. That equation is length of the fish from the tip of the mouth to the tip of the tail. So length of the fish times length of the fish times girth of the fish, which is a measurement around the fattest part of the fish, all divided by 1200. And that will give you a very uh, accurate weight in pounds. And I'll show you that in just one second. All right, guys. Well, I just caught a nice bass and I want to get a decent weight on this bass, but I don't have a scale. So what do I do? All right, well, all I need is this tape measure. Easy fabric tape measure, flexible one. It's the best way to go. All right, so you take from the close of the fish's mouth, you take from right here, the zero right here, take the length of the fish, pinch that tail together and get the length of that fish, all right? So I have 16 inches or close to 16, 16 inches, okay? And that's my length. The next thing is I wanna figure out where the thickest part of that bass is, which is right here. I wanna make sure that fin is down. Okay, so I'm gonna lay my bass down on the deck of my boat, lay that fin down. Now I don't wanna squeeze the bass. I just wanna eat, uh, lay it gently on, him, on, the, on the fish and overlap the tape measure, okay? All right, so without squeezing that fish, it comes to 13 inches, okay? Right on the girth, the thickest part of that fish. So I, my length was 16, and my girth was 13. I wanna take 16 times 16 times 13, all of that divided by 1200. And that will give me the weight of this fish. So the weight of this fish would turn out to be 2.77 pounds. Now, you need to remember that 0.77 isn't seven ounces. That is 0.77 of 16 ounces. So that's almost another pound. So that 0.77 would actually come to almost three quarters of a pound of, a, of fish. So if there are 16 ounces in one pound, three quarters of a pound would be about 12 ounces. So this bass here would weigh two pounds and 12 ounces or right there about. Good luck out there on the water and as always, tight lines. 